Oh my gosh, you guys, I'm so, so excited to show you how I made this jerk pork. Oh, it's my favorite Jamaican dish to make, and I know you guys are gonna love it, so if you wanna learn how I did this, just keep watching. So, these are all the ingredients that I will be using to make my jerk pork. All the things will be listed in the description box down below, so make sure that you check that because your girl doesn't leave anything out, okay? So, we're gonna start off by cleaning our meat. And you wanna make sure that you do that with every meat that you're cooking. I just do it off camera, but make sure you do it because if you're eating dirty meat, girl, what are you doing? Okay, so I cut it up into these nice big pieces like so. And now I'm gonna start the marinade and seasoning process. So as you guys already know, the ingredients, seasonings are listed in the order in which they appear in the description box. You're about to see me go in with this jerk seasoning and I just want to warn y'all that this stuff can be spicy so don't add a lot of this okay it was my first time using it and it was coming out of the the bottle hard so I was just like trying to force it out and your girl just did a lot okay so if you like spicy food it's okay to add this much but just you know be careful <laughs> so now I'm just gonna go ahead and mix everything together as you guys know everything needs to be touched and rubbed I don't want any pieces of my meat to go unseasoned okay so just spread the love all the way around like you know like how the disciples spread the word you know the gospel spread the seasoning over the meat so they all get touched and covered okay everybody needs to feel the blessing of the seasonings okay because our taste buds deserve it all okay so just make sure that you rubbing in all these seasonings for this marinade and it's gonna sit for at least two hours or overnight so everything can soak in okay so if you're not new to the channel then you know that your girl has already uploaded a video on how to make Jamaican rice and peas so I'm not gonna show you exactly how I do that in this video make sure that you click the card above so you can see how I made this it's very easy okay and if you're not subscribed to the channel girl what are you doing subscribe to the channel okay so our meat should be ready to go into the oven I made sure that I put it in uncovered for 15 minutes at 425 degrees so it looked like this and it can be nice and brown as you can see it already looks good but that's not all folks okay so we're gonna turn the heat down to 325 and you're gonna cover it with aluminum foil and cook it for one hour after that this is how your meat should look 
Oh my goodness, you guys. This meat is just like, I outdid myself with this, okay? Like, this is just the best. So go ahead and take your little notes now. Redo this and let me know how you liked it, okay? So there's some people who don't like to add a lot of gravy to their rice. So, you know, this little pan is for you guys, okay? So just take in the juiciness of this jerk pork. Like, look at that. It's just beautiful isn't she isn't she lovely isn't she wonderful yes she is okay so this pan is for the people who like to have gravy like just covering sourced up dressed on your rice and peas that's how i like to have mine so that's pretty much it you guys i hope you enjoyed this video let me know how you liked it make sure you subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys in the next one bye